Hello there everybody, I'm gonna be teaching you how to get the pre-release of Minecraft 1.8. What you're gonna do is download the link in the description and save it to your desktop. Um, I accidentally delete, or no, um, go on make a few copies just in case, I mean, um, save it to your desktop so you remember it. Um, it'll be on your desktop. But what you're going to do is open Windows Explorer, um, go to your user, app data roaming dot minecraft, go in your bin folder, and replace the minecraft dot jar. Actually, if you have the other version, uh, delete your bin folder, um, or no, do force update, I'm sorry, um, force, once you force the update, go into the bin, or after you force the update, close it, um, go into the bin, you delete this version of it and you drag the new one into it it'll keep all your saves um, and you will also have the new version of minecraft I'll even prove it to you um, login may take a minute um, well, it'll say, like, can't connect to Minecraft.net because it hasn't been officially released. So you can't play multiplayer. Well, I don't think you can play multiplayer in this. Um, sorry, it takes a minute. Then, yeah, it'll say connect, cannot connect to Minecraft.net. Just do play offline. As you can see, it's the new Minecraft. Um, um, new options. Um... Difficulty, video, like, you can change the brightness. Um, then, single player, it'll be, uh, you can do survival or creative. Um, I'll do survival. Oh, crap. <laughs> um, and some new features are um, new mobs, um, sprinting, a ton of other stuff, and hunger bar experience. Uh, pretty updated graphics. This is sprinting. But, yep, it's Minecraft 1.8. And and even Notch said it's okay to use this version because it's kind of like a beta for a beta, like to kind of test out to see fix any bit bugs. But yeah, that's how you get Minecraft 1.8 for free.